now, now. Officer, how can I go in there? Can I go down? No? That way? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Somebody. I'm not very oh, Yeah, I'm not very good camera either. Sorry. <laughs> I know somebody was in charge. Do you know who was? You can ask some of the the tour guides. They'd be happy to speak with you. Yeah, I was thinking about them. Yeah, yeah. And they'll give you Jewish reasons to be in the Zionist. Okay. Excuse me. So, someone, someone is like in charge that can talk about okay. what you're doing today. You, you, you give us two minutes. Let me just, okay. Uh, yeah. At the beginning, the police make a problem to take down the signs, so they want to take it away. So when you just uh, mm. take away the signs, then we can. Okay. You can find the over there. Oh. Who's there? Oh yeah. Give me a little Hey. Can, nice can, you. can you or somebody talk about yes. what you were doing? Yes. Do you have today? Yes, somebody can take him. But the thing is, nicht. Is nicht. Uh, give me a minute. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Okay. Uh, can I keep you five minutes, four minutes? Yeah, yeah. We just okay. need to wrap up. You, we have pressure from the police. Yeah, it's okay. But there was there was a whole controversy. Yeah. yeah. The boys, I like the arm. Give me a book. And then tell me the other side. Hello. Oh yeah. Well. Can you do it? Yeah. So talk about why you are here. I know why you are here, but I need right, right. you, somebody. Right. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. You know something? Just give me one beer for one five beers. Give me one man that. You know yeah. something? Okay. 
So just say anything you well, want. With the help of the Almighty, the reason we've gathered here, Jews who are true to the religion of Judaism, um, because simply we are being misrepresented. They have here, the unfortunately, the people parading and celebrating uh, the establishment of the State of Israel that's basically hijacking the name Israel, hijacked the, the, the Star of David. Well, Judaism is a religion to be subservient to God. It's 3,000 years, around 3,000 years old. Zionism is 75 years and it's a transformation to nationalism, to occupy another people's land, to steal, to kill. And uh, ironically, even as Jews, since 2,000 years ago, since the destruction of the temple, we're not even allowed to have our own sovereignty. So this whole concept, their celebration where you have boys and girls singing and marching in the name of our God, in the name, is all a farce. It's unacceptable. It's a rebellion against God. It's, uh, and Jews around the world, whether here in the United States, or you go in the US, in UK, or in Canada, or in Jerusalem, in Al-Quds, you will find invariably that the very religious community stands in unison in the opposition to the, uh, to the whole concept of the State of Israel. It's just simply unacceptable. And uh, a lot of times I like to show pictures how we used to live together. I like to show pictures how we would have demonstrations of tens of thousands of Jews in Al-Quds in Jerusalem or in Washington. These are all the very religious Jews. The Zionists, you can see the farce. Ben-Gurion declared his state in 1948. Not one of them is even covering their heads. The rabbis, who, who were the real cheap rabbis of Palestine, not the, the Israeli rabbinate, which is also a farce, window dressing, but the chief rabbis and the ra stood up and said, we furthermore wish to express our definite opposition to a Jewish state in any part of Palestine. And since then, we've been demonstrating in the tens of thousands, and young children, old men, get brutally beaten, Jewish people, not just Palestinians, simply because they're standing there demonstrating. We don't have guns, they can't accuse us of being uh, terrorists, and yet they brutally beat with impunity beat and arrest boys and girls because they refuse to serve in the army. They brutally beat young men, old men, children. It's unbelievable. This is daily happening and the world is silent and uh, turns a blind eye to what's happening in Palestine. This is totally unacceptable. They're spraying them with chemicals to discourage demonstrations because their clothes get ruined. And like I say, this is ongoing daily. It's the sad tale of the state of Israel. A, a state that is really illegitimate, unacceptable, and yet has the audacity to speak in the name of our religion. But again, we encourage everybody to go to the very religious. You will hear, we pray every day for the total and speedy, God help, peaceful removal of this impediment to peace, this cause of hate, this cause of exacerbating anti-Semitism around the world, this cause of so much bloodshed of Palestinians and of Jews. We plead everybody to uh, pray to God, and God should help His compassion bring an end to the Zionist state soon in our days. We can live again in peace and harmony with the Palestinian people, with the Arab people. Another issue is that we have to show our uh, gratitude to the Muslim people and the and um, and, and around the world. They, they they embraced the Jews. They gave us a home, even in Palestine, included in the Ottoman Empire. Even though we have a distinctly different religion. Nothing, it's not a religious conflict. This was never a reason of conflict. The Zionists want to declare it's a religious conflict. Nothing could be further from the truth. It's a simple, uh, selfish, political, nationalist movement of Zionism of 75 years, a little older, and they're masquerading in the name of Judaism. But it's nothing with religion. God will help. It will be removed. We can give back the Palestinian people their respect the land and peace and we can live together in peace. It won't be you up. So you Thank you.